The clock is ticking as the world intensifies its efforts to contain the coronavirus spread. Here at home, the health department admits that there have been limitations in testing suspected coronavirus cases, but they are exploring options. A very rapid increase in the number of cases, which also means that there's going to be an increase in the number of patients that we need to test. On Tuesday, the Food and Drug Administration approves a test kit developed by scientists from the University of the Philippines. It's been ready for, uh, I think, at least a month. Uh, talagang nakita naman nila no, upon repeated testing that it's a very accurate test. The newly developed test kit, however, is still under a pending request for validation from the World Health Organization. But the FDA clarifies that the kits can accurately test the coronavirus strain. Unfortunately, yung WHO validation might be a process of two to three months and we cannot wait that long. The FDA says tests will also require swab sampling from patients. Pero ganun pa rin, nasal swab tsaka oropharyngeal swab. The FDA adds that a layer of tests is in place to confirm the coronavirus. Pag nag-test sila ng pasyente, meron kasabay din yun na genetic sequencing. Ang next generation sequencing, malaki talaga ang maitutulong, which is actually what was done in Wuhan. Processing the results will require a shorter amount of time. It will also cost less, which is 1,500 pesos per test compared to the existing 20,000 pesos per coronavirus test. Sa ngayon, no, it takes about 24 hours to run the PCR test. Ito ang running time niya na decrease nila to less than 2 hours. It's quicker and cheaper. Experts say that the new test kit developed by the Filipino scientists could definitely make an impact in the country's fight against the coronavirus disease or COVID-19. The FDA expects that the new test kits will roll out soon, testing 1,000 people every week. Tristan Udalo, CNN Philippines.